Hello and welcome back to the Glory Glory Man United Save episode 93 and today we're going to bring you Burnley game in the Premiership and then Copenhagen in the Champions League. So let's uh, find out how we did when we last from the last episode. Uh, so after the Bournemouth 1-1 draw we went on to beat Liverpool 4-1. That was, um, was a really good game. Uh, Akadi, Lukaku, Netin 2 and Guedes again for, um, with another goal. He's coming into his own now and he's scoring quite a few goals. Granted, they're only one at a time, but he's still like almost won a game and I'm sure he's got about three or four on the bounce now, but kind of finished Liverpool off really with the third goal to put us back two goals back in front. Stats-wise, we, um, we gave him a little bit of a pasting and I don't think I've had that much possession and shots and everything else versus Liverpool, so... I'm, I'm, I'm rather pleased myself over that. This was a game that Icardi got himself injured. Foot injury it was, and he was out for a good five months, I think it is. One of their months is gone. He's still got another two to four months left. Well, all I can say is a good job we have Lakaku, who is putting it in the net, because otherwise we would really be struggling. We followed the win at, uh, over Liverpool with the 5-2 win over Copenhagen, which was expected. Uh, um, Titi got sent off though in this game in the 22nd minute but we still managed to come out 5-2 winners that's how poor these guys really were uh, Rashford scoring a brace Guedes again scoring and Lukaku with another brace uh, he, he really cannot stop scoring follow that with a 2-0 win against West Ham Lukaku again this time K Kingsley Coman scoring and then in the Carabao Cup we played a few of the youngsters um, Tala uh, Goldbraith and a new signing from the other 23s Lamar Wincup he got himself injured straight away virtually so hurrah and Carlos Magno coming in on the right back as well even though he is a first teamer even though he's a backup to the first team to Kimmich we did let him play in this one and to be perfectly honest Arsenal were all over us they just virtually battered us we were just totally outplayed there's, there's no other words for it Thankfully, it was only the Carabao Cup, and uh, glad to see the back of it, really. It's just uh, infringement on our fixture list, really, the Carabao. But let's get straight into the matters, anyway. Uh, away to Burnley, we have got Donnarumma in goal, Kimmich, Sula, Caldera, and Hernandez at the back. We have got Savage and Sanchez in the middle. Guedes, Havertz, Coman attacking midfield, and, of course, Lukaku up front. We are going to miss Icardi. Although saying that he's only scored four goals this season, Lukaku's on 17 already. He's he's really stepped his game up a bit. It has to be said. Rashford did deputise for, for Ricardo when they went two up front, and he scored six as well. So I'm hoping Guedes and Coman can come into the road now. Guedes is on he's scored well. He has scored six goals, and I think he's scored four in the last six himself actually. So we're not really missing Dembele that much. Although we will, I prefer to have him though. Rashford. You possibly can come in for Coman, but Coman is better suited, really, I think, for that position at the moment. And he seems to be a lot fitter. So, we are going to continue attacking. Okay, so Burnley. Well, they're playing the tree formation. Tom Heaton, how's he doing? Um, Not doing that bad. Conceding an awful lot of goals, though. So, really, we ought to try and get a few shots on him. Uh, Chris Wood up front, is it Chris Wood? It is. And what's he doing? He hasn't scored any goals so far this season. They picked him up from Leeds or the many seasons ago for 18 million. Tad much, you think? I, I would say so. So let's go straight to the changing rooms. Let's get this game underway. Let's do this for the fans. All right, they listen keenly. So we'll just say, you know what, guys? Assertive, they want to see a good performance from you all today. And some are motivated. I won't say I, I motivate players, but uh, I do like to think I can get the best out of them. Havertz is having another go in attacking midfielder role. Just behind the uh, forward. Just found Lakaku, in fact. And uh, he really needs to step his game up a little bit. I mean, it's his favourite position. That's offside, surely. That's right. Sam Larson, sorry, you. And Cohen's off injured. What did I say about Rashford and Coman? Straight swap. Let's see if we can uh, get on the attack. Matty, Matty Jew? 
Mateju for Burnley, not heard of him. Has to be. Right, Rashford over the top to Lukaku's waiting. He's well I'll try to find him. Sanchez. Burnley are probably one of our bogey teams, really. Over to Hernandez. Ball in maybe. Back post, not quite, but Kimmich can get there, he can put it back in to Sanchez. He plays it all the way back to Caldera there. I'm not sure what I was thinking there. Penalty referee. And he has awarded a penalty. How many penalties we seem to be getting is uh, quite good. Come on, Lakaku. Stop. Oh, he sends the goalkeeper the wrong way. Fantastic. So, confident penalties. Well into the other side of the corner from Lakaku. Fantastic stuff. And we're on the attack again. Sanchez with the ball to Savic. Plays it inside. Not quite the clear. Roberts comes away with it. Straight up to Chris Wood at top. But we have it about Havertz. Down the line to Guedes. Cross, and that should have been a goal by Savage. We have scored 26 goals already this season, but not quite as many as uh, we normally have at this stage. Rashford picks up a yellow card, while Donnarumma takes a goal kick, and Roberts comes forward again onto the ball to Ward. We tackle, and that's Lukaku picking it up. Oh, he's still got it though. Sidestep the Burnley guy. Guedes, ball in. Not quite. Kimmich picks up. Straight back to Guedes. Savage now. And that's almost a goal. Coming up to half time. Can we hold him at bay? And that's a cracking goal. But that should never have been. A, maybe a case we have to go two up front. Because it's not working, is it? Just having one. And that's a. Donnarumma, which way were you diving, man? Come on, half time referee. You allowed too much time then for them to come back into the game. Uh, let's go aggressive and let's say I'm far from pleased. Let's give him a kick up the bum, demand a bit more, and if uh, we'll change it in the next 15 20 minutes if we can. Kimmich with the ball down the line to Havertz, inside to Savic, who's going back out to the line. Sanchez straight across, and oh, we do get it, and Rashford this time with a miss. Do we have anybody to go on the left hand side? Guedes might have to come on that side, bring Bale on, move Rashford up front, because we are a little bit under the cosh. In fact, I'm going to change it now because it, that formation just doesn't work. Right, we're going to go two up front, Rashford's going to come, move up front. We've got Guedes coming over to the left hand side, Bale on the right. We've taken Havertz off uh, and Sanchez as well. And hopefully we can uh, get some order back into these games. Can't afford to be dropping points on silly games where we should be winning, especially when we've gone into the lead. Right, Kimmich with the throw. Lukaku, back to Kimmich. Come on, this time. Ball in. Rashford, get in. And that is the movement we're after. Rashford goes straight up front and scores. And it's disallowed. Wow. Kimmich again there. Can we get the same sort of ball in? I had my suspicions it was offside, but I never thought we would have done. Rashford should have been more careful. Oh, it's a loose ball. And Burnley coming forward. Oh, Guedes, lovely ball out to Bale. Bale, ball in. Must be a goal this time. And Lakaku, who's been on fire all this time. Savage is absolutely cream crackered now. But unfortunately, we can't do anything about it. Come on. Last minute. And that's it. Time up. Let's get it away. And that's it, 1-1 one, one away from home to Burnley. Not doing too well away from home again, disappointing. So we are top of the table. Man City have got a game in hand, so it looks like we'll be chasing again. But that's the second draw we've had away from home. So Burnley and Bournemouth, they are holding us, but that's a poor result. Coman's going to be injured and he's totally out for eight months. Oh my word. Cruciate ligaments. Oh no. Well, that does mean we're going to have to look for a right... Well, Guedes can play there. Well, Guedes and Rashford's the only players we've got left now, haven't we? And Bale. Right, we've got the Champions League coming up. We'll see you guys for that game in a few minutes. It's moving on to the Copenhagen game. We've picked up quite a few injuries now. A card is gone. Um, Titi, he's suspended. And Komen's out for so many months as well. So we are virt almost down to the bare bones. And not quite though but we virtually have got the, some first teamers out so we're going to have Donnarumma in goal Alaba comes in for um, Hernandez that's the early change at the back we have 
got Cruz and Saul in the middle this time. Guedes and Rashford out on the wings. Havertz behind Lakaku again. I'm hoping Havertz is going to have a better game. Uh, he likes to play shots, play one twos, cuts inside from both wings. Second game of the episode. Hopefully we can fare better and come out a lot better. Again, we can make them changes if need be. Cruz and Sowell, sort of the same sort of players in midfield. We've taken Savage out, give him a bit of a break. I'm hoping them to can find the partnership between them. So let's go ahead and submit this game. 4-4-1-1 this time. They're, they're just playing safe, aren't they? We don't want that. We're just going to go straight at them. Straight from the off, guys. Come on. That's great triangle play, but Lukaku's under it. But we have the ball again. Guedes out wide. Lovely play inside and penalty ref. Nothing doing. Alaba should be able to pick that up. We'll get anybody down the line. Copenhagen come f well with a throw and it easily uh, intercepted. And Guedes is going for a run. Oh, he's on his way, look. Look at that. The ball is not a great one. Oh, that was a loose ball straight to Cruz. Akaku to Rashford and that's a headed back to the goalkeeper which we should be able to pick up straight away. We do, Cruz back out wide to Alaba, Alaba with the ball over to Guedes. Down the line again and that should be in and Lakaku scores again. Crack, he's, he's on fire. Beautiful assist by Guedes as well. And uh, well if we win this one, I could, well, we won't have to play them other games because we'll be through. We are eight points clear, two games left. Although Dortmund haven't played yet. You would expect them to win their game against Roma. But that's a finish by Rashford. What a strike from the left-hand side. Oh, they're asking for offside and not giving it. How can it be? Lakaku down it. Ooh, well, I tell you what, it's a cracking goal, but that is right on the nail that is we we'll come away with it again Rashford this time over the top to Lukaku and uh, Copenhagen are chasing oh that's close pity couldn't hold it up a bit more Saul with the ball comes forward holds it up Sula now to Cruz quite the German side we've got going on here Guedes to Cruz Havertz and we should be finishing Lukaku does very very easily the goalkeeper didn't really want to collect that did he Beautiful play there. Guedes gets it, plays one two with the defender, then finds Cruz to Havertz and Havertz with the assist this time. Didn't notice that before. I've got him holding the ball up a bit more and a bit more direct passing as well. I'm going off wide a little bit as well in his instructions. And he seems to be liking that and much better. And we are 3 0 up and cruising. Tottenham are being absolutely hammered. Martial scoring. Uh, just how, how is he doing? Scored three since his £90 million move to us. <laughs> From us, should I say. I really didn't want to let him go. Uh, just going to say, don't get complacent. Let's carry on. Right, coming up to 20 minutes to go. And what I might do is just change it around a little bit. Um, Guedes could come off for uh, Bale. Then Donka, you can come in at the back. Um, we're holding our own, but we're going to give um, Caldera... A rest and we'll leave it for now ease Dendonka back into the uh, into the fray of things Akaku spent and he seems to be struggling out there a little bit Rashford he wants his hat trick so I'm gonna leave him out this but there's nothing wrong with them there running onto that ball apart from the finish Rashford up front and Lakaku could come off for put Hernandez up there see what he can do he can play along he can play up there right Final minutes. Novak with the ball for Copenhagen and Donnarumma should get there quite comfortably. It's a great ball by Alaba. Over to Rashford who holds it up to Hernandez who comes in. Havertz with through ball to Rashford again and again we miss a chance on goal. The finishing is not great at all. Bale inside to Cruz this time so hopefully we can well it's not that we need to win by loads, I admit, but goals would be good. Oh, that's a great take by Rashford, who just plays it out. Right, time must be up now, referee. That's it, final whistle. To say that pff, we had most of the game is an understatement, really. If you ignore the possession, 
17 shots we've had and half of them we saw them going wide uh, yeah they did well we'll give them, give them their dues we, ha well, we don't hammer but we should have confirmation that we do go through uh, there it is we qualify for the first knockout round that is that done wow with two games left in the group as well uh, Lakaku on form so we'll praise him well done Slutsky who's Slutsky? England boss Leonard Slutsky who are you? Russian. We've got a Russian manager for the England team. Real Madrid beat Tottenham 5-0 in the end. It's a pace and a half, isn't it, really? See how the rest of the teams did. But either way, we do qualify. Dortmund win 1-0 as well. We are going to leave it there. We're going to play a few more games. We may come back to the Dortmund game. I'm expecting that to be a formality. So really, it's top of table clash or Dortmund. So what I might do, we might come... Well, we'll play a few games, see how it goes. Uh, we're already through to the from the Champions League, so we might come back down here somewhere. Quite possibly the Man City, if not the Dortmund, but we'll see how it goes. And if we do need to play Dortmund for the top of the table, then we'll play that one. But more than likely Man City and possibly Newcastle as well. But until then, if you enjoyed that video, please pop a like on there. If you'd like to see more, please subscribe. And until next time, thank you very much for watching. Thank you. Mm -hmm.